everyone and welcome to chtv at home i'm your host calem i'm joined by your other host for today santi how are you everybody hey guys so uh we just got a little bit of good news for you guys you know everything's kind of been uh sad with the quarantine so we're just gonna try to lighten up your day a bit we have a story about a 99 year old british world war ii veteran and he raised 22 million dollars from the national health service santi what like i know it's crazy <laughs> captain tom war 99 years old he set out to walk 100 laps around his 50 yard backyard right to raise uh, money for the nhs right with a broken hip and a walker he managed to well not only surpass his goal he of 100 laps he surpassed his goal of a thousand pounds to 18 million pounds in only 11 days with 900,000 donors that's absolutely unbelievable uh so thank you captain tom moore <laughs> hello people in quarantine i'm back in again as your host annie huang and i will be interviewing the one and only person who has the best hair at clayton mr <laughs> sims <laughs> i appreciate that are you ready oh, for wow. some questions yeah yeah, yeah let's okay do so starting off easy what's the first thing you do in the morning brush my teeth um, okay, let me paint you a picture. So all of a sudden, you find out that you have this fantastic singing voice and you realize that you can become a new famous singer. What would the name of your debut album be? Okay, I just I just want to be clear about something. Like, what do you mean if I had a good voice? Isn't that what you just said? Like, like <laughs> no, 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 no. Okay. okay, sorry. Can we go through that again then? What's your question? I just want to clarify. Okay, 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 okay. So with your really good voice, <laughs> better that's so you much realize better that you can be okay. a really good singer what would the name of your album be oh um it's straight out of Abbotsford. that's what that's, <laughs> that's what i would call it yeah for sure what was the last movie or show you watched are you even asking it was star wars why is that why are we even talking? i just have to ask for everyone else you know I just watched it last night while I was marking. I mean, is oh, this just wow. not what everyone does? Uh, what's your favorite and least favorite part about online classes? Um, the least favorite part is easy. It's just not being able to see people, right? Like that's that's super that's super easy. I guess in some ways though, that could almost be my favorite part. Is that <laughs> and my final question for you. I don't know if you'll share it with us, but do you have any tips on how you keep your hair looking almost as good as yours? Almost as good? What do you mean? It's good all the time. Like No, 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 no. For us to even like compare to yours. I see. Um, you know, you have to be you have to be careful with it. You know, like you can't overly style it all the time. <laughs> you know, and here I am having this interview and my luscious hair is all covered up because sometimes <laughs> It, it can be out in the sun. You really like you. Yeah, just, sometimes it's it, just too much. It is too much, right? It is too much. You you don't want too much sun damage, right? You don't want oh, to over condition, okay, okay. right? You like not too much product in there. Oh. Uh, yeah, it's like a, like less is more kind of thing. Mm -hmm. Yeah, like that's well, that's you. that's my thank best you. advice. Anything else you want to say to everyone? Oh, uh, who's gonna see this? Is, uh, the, our last video got like 500 views. Can you imagine people sitting in their houses watching us? <laughs> I know. All, things. <laughs> all right, awesome. Okay, thank you. And that's it for our quarantine queries. Yeah, now we got a little bit of fake news. Um, Donald Trump. <laughs> Telling people to inject disinfect it into their uh, into their bloodstream. Don't do that, bruh. No, it, it's not good for you. It's not good for you. It says on the <laughs> bottle of Lysol wipes, uh, "Don't put this in your eyes because it will hurt." Yes, these so-called miracle cures for the COVID nineteen are obviously not true. If if they weren't, we would be using them right now, and we would not be in the video call, right? Yeah. Um, chat the mushrooms. I think you just smoke those. I don't know, but don't. I don't even it. know what those are. <laughs> No, I don't know either. You know what? And let's just leave them. Let's not touch them. Yeah. We just want to have a little mention. Uh, I'm sure everybody's heard about the Nova Scotia shooting uh, that just happened last week. Um, we'd just like to take a moment to send our condolences and our thoughts and our prayers to the families who've lost uh, loved ones um, to this shooting. 
it's just it's absolutely horrible we just want to let them know that we're thinking of them right here on the uh west we're still we're still together in this we might be on the other side of the country but we will get through this yo what's up guys welcome to tv show review <laughs> with your boy timmy and chad Men's born. All right, so like, I know y'all are all bored out there in you know quarantine. Y'all want some shows to watch? We got you. So first show we come up. I should just hold this up, and you should already know what it is. If you don't, then you're dead to me. Um, Bro, last damn. dance. Yeah, it's the last dance. You know, documentary with uh, Michael Jordan, the goat. At which some people may hit me for that. That's okay. Uh yeah, yeah. No, it's, he's he's the absolute goat. Follows his story, and you know, just he's freaking great. Like, look at Kevin. He just knows, bro. Oh, I know, bro. I know, I know. So, yo, Kevin, what do you rate The Last Dance mm -hmm. out of 10, man? I rate mean, uh, 23 out of 10. For oh, yo, why jersey you... number and everything, two, three. Ooh, I like that. I like that. So, yo, Kevin, what's the other show that we wanted to tell these people about? I, I'm telling you, first of all, I want to say LeBron's a good. Second of all, Tiger King up, up here, right? <laughs> it's, about, it's about some... Yo, Some woman ki killing killing husbands and and tigers and, and stuff like that. Carol Baskin. Uh, uh, <laughs> yeah, that's literally it. It's just tigers. Yeah, pretty much, pretty much. I rated a I rated a five husband out of ten for and, the five uh, husbands she had. A seven one hundred seventy six tigers works, man. out of ten too. How many tigers out of ten? One hundred seventy six. Yeah, I rated one hundred seventy six tigers out of ten. So yeah, yo. Dubs. These are like both shows you should like binge over quarantine because it's exactly. fun and it's great. <laughs> Pass you guys on to whatever the editors have planned next. So see ya, Timmy out. That's a lot, boys. That's a lot. Monday. Tuesday. Wednesday. Thursday. Friday. This is Parnit, a current Clayton Heights senior student. She works at Walmart during this time, and we would just like to thank you so much for all your work, Parnit. You're an inspiration to your peers. Keep it up.